Dr. Sri Nagesh here, a board certificate plastic surgeon specializing in body contouring procedures. Uh, today I want to talk to you about a liposync technique that is relatively new to the uh, world of plastic surgery, that is water assisted liposuction. Now, are you struggling with stubborn fat deposit? This particular thing is a problem always in many people. Despite diet and exercise, certain areas in the body do not uh, reduce, they are quite stubborn like the love handles, bulges the, uh, around the belly button, thighs, uh, the saddlebag areas or sometimes even the arms. These areas don't uh, reduce uh, with whatever kind of exercise, diet and other things that you do. So such a situation, you, know, you should understand that you know, one, you are not alone and Many people struggle with these areas, making them feel very self-conscious because they don't get proper uh, fitting clothes and when they wear clothes, trendy clothes and all this, those areas show up as small little bulges which may be quite embarrassing to earn. So what is so different uh, about this water assisted liposuction which I just made to traditional liposuction. So what is traditional liposuction? Traditional liposuction has been around for you know many many uh, decades. Now uh, it is uh, relatively tough procedures, it uses sheer force of the hands uh, along with the strong negative pressure of the machine to forcefully suck out the unwanted fat which sometimes can be more uh, injurious to the surrounding tissues can lead to uneven. So one does not appreciate uneven results you know when they want to go for a surgical procedure. Now I shall be introducing you to this uh, method of water assisted liposuction. So is there a better way and what? how is water assisted liposuction better than the other uh, methods of liposuction. So now we should know how water assisted liposuction works. Lipos this water assisted liposuction is otherwise called the body jet and does not use too much of fluid to, uh, to be infiltrated into the tissue before the fat can be aspirated. So what we do is this particular filtration fluid is you know a very little amount is given in that area just to numb the area rather than to you know cause a tumescence that is you know fill up overfill the area with large amount of water. So what is this uh, disadvantage of using a uh, solution? If a person, if you use too much of a solution and that goes into the circulation, it can cause a water overload and it can cause uh, sometimes uh, heart failure kind of a situation or a pulmonary embolism or, or these kind of uh, issues. Especially sometimes if the procedure is long, it can happen in the theatre, sometimes it can happen once the patient is shifted out of the uh, theatre into the uh, ward or to the recovery home. So, here yeah, what happens is in all liposuctions, we have a probe or a cannula which goes into the body and with a to and fro motion, we aspirate the fat after the infiltration. Here, what happens is this liposuction probe or the cannula is a very uh, is very unique in the sense that the tip of the cannula has is a, a small uh, hole which is beveled at an angle of around 65 degrees. So this sends a jet of water into the tip as a small little spray and this particular uh, uh, liquid not only dislodges the fat but also has a little bit of an anesthetic fluid and uh, vasopressin element medicine medication which reduces the bleeding dislodges the fat and causes local you know gives anesthetic effect in that area while the unwanted dislodged fat is sucked out from uh, two or three other holes adjacent to it back into the machine so there is very little harm to the fat cells to the blood vessels the nerves the other tissues or even the skin above the uh, which is draping the body now this next is the emulsification suction. This, this emulsification suction, both of them take place parallelly. So the excess amount of fluid that is sprayed into the body is also aspirated out simultaneously so that you know, there is no fluid overload in the body. So this is a very big advantage, a very gentle kind of a procedure and you know, it can be done on any part of the body right from the face, neck, chest, abdomen, arms, thighs, buttocks, legs. So almost the whole body is covered. Even the back also can be done in a very uh, smooth and gentle manner. So once you have decided to go for a liposuction and you have already gone for a liposuction, let us say, you need to know what care you need to take after the procedure is done. That is the post operative care for liposuction. So in the advantage of this water assisted liposuction is that the recovery is typically very fast to recover very fast swelling the typical uh, issues after liposuction are uh, inflammation swelling leakage from the session sites and the 
post op recovery these all things you know take place very rapidly uh, the post op discharge uh, reduces in a day or two and uh, unlike with some other procedures you know sometimes you may get the smell of a burnt tissue or something like that all those things are not there uh, bleeding is very very minimal and uh, the post op swelling is not much and uh, the bleeding is not much so you know very little bruising sometimes in some issues cases when the skin is too uh, thin fragile or you have an underlying this or you have uh, missed talking to the doctor telling the doctor that you know you've been taking some uh, medications like uh, ecosporin or you know blood thinners or you have some other uh, underlying medical uh, conditions otherwise you know the bruising also is quite minimal in these kind of cases and you need to wear a compression garment for a few weeks to help you with uh, swelling and to promote uh, healing uh, in a more uh, nice manner which you are. Uh, one important thing one know is uh, liposuction is not a way weight loss tool it is a body contouring tool and those who are looking for sculpting or you know, getting rid of stubborn body fat will benefit the most and those who are closer to their ideal body weight and you no know, look good and trendy and smart uh, this is a very good procedure and to learn more about this particular procedure i think you know you should uh, get in touch with uh, our team at www.ojasaesthetic.com or you can contact us at our ojas aesthetic which is situated at madhapur hyderabad Now, another advantage of this water-assisted liposuction, uh, namely body jet, is two other reasons which it can be used. One is uh, for a particular condition called lipidema. Lipidema is a condition, a connective tissue disorder, which uh, unfortunately affects almost 10 to 15 percent of women, and uh, which largely goes misdiagnosed and is a mis- is a misunderstood disease, subclassified as pear-shaped obesity, which slowly progresses to lymphedema and huge elephant kind of. of legs called elephant asses or lymphedema uh, if those patients are identified early then water assisted liposuction helps in a big way in getting rid of this unwanted body fat while protecting the lymphatic system the venous and the other important vital structures inside the body in the body especially in the lower limbs and the upper limbs and uh, one more advantage of this particular uh, uh, equipment is that it has got a container called a lipo collector where you can harvest extra body fat which can be used for many other conditions like fat grafting uh, for those people ladies who have smaller breasts want breast enhancement they can use it for you know uh, breast aid, uh, augmentation those who want to have a facial rejuvenation or uh, you know uh, a dark under circle around the eyes you can use that fat to augment in those areas and give a rejuvenated appearance and uh, you know get rid of the tired sleepy appearance and also uh, this uh, same thing can also uh, the fat that is harvested is a very good quality fat and can be used to generate stem cells for uh, rejuvenation therapy especially for the knee joints the hip joints elbow joints or you know so many other conditions rejuvenative therapy and uh, to now to add to all these things is another thing all the experience that i have acquired almost 2011 using this particular equipment and the various uh, modalities of treatments and the benefits that you know, can be passed on to the patient uh, with this particular equipment i have uh, written two articles one on uh, lipidema because i am uh, pioneering in this particular uh, field presently from asia and secondly i have also written a chapter in a, a book recently which has been published so about water assisted liposuction and its benefits and the advantages which uh, lipidema patient can uh, get from uh, this particular uh, procedure uh, thank you